The 2018 Altima comes in S, SR, SV, and SL trims. Everything except the SR have a typical look, with a liberally chiseled physique that is developed recognizable in its 5 years out and about. It's ordinary by the present sheet metal gauges and it's inside might have originated from a mid-1990s Volkswagen, so customary it is in its design and repressed trim. Stopped beside the striking new Chevy Malibu and Honda Accord, the Altima resembles the auto of some rental armada chief's fantasy, if rental armada supervisors were permitted to dream without the typical legally binding waiver or extra expense. Steadily tuned for that fanciful place we call the standard, the four-barrel Nissan Altima has 179 torque, an extravagant ride, and a CVT that has been so vigorously modified and customized it's relatively unrecognizable from a six-speed programmed. Those are solid words for a gadget so castigated through history, yet it's actual, and it's one reason the four-barrel Altima still merits a look. That, and 38 miles per gallon interstate will get you someplace, cheaply. The 270 horsepower V6 guarantees great circumstances, yet the Altima's guiding is difficult to roust from its snooze. Altima SR models have marginally stiffer tuning, however in general, we'd rather have the tasty Maxima and its clever mix of ride and dealing with. The 5 situate Altima has fine inside room and a decent level of trim and seat comfort. It's calmer than in past years, as well. There's nothing particularly debauched about its inside trim. However it's less simple than the Fusion and as a matter of fact less bold than the Accord and Camry and Impala. The Altima keeps on doing great in crash tests, and this year Nissan makes forward impact notices with programmed crisis braking standard over the line. 